Hey guys, welcome back. So, I wonder who that mystery man is. Or girl. Could be either man or man or woman. Family picture. Sorry, sorry. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. We didn't There's know that it was the working. End of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit Chuck. about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense! Why would they bring out the dead like that, and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't crap, crap, crap. with you. Whoever it was, seems like they're following us. I don't like being followed. All the more reason to get on a damn boat where we can't be followed. I'm not going back out there anytime soon. Omid needs to rest. We need to make sure Chuck is okay. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head towards the river. See if we can find him. Deal? Suit yourselves, but I'm not gonna wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. Uh, pretty sure there's nobody else in the city or town, or whatever. They seem secure at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door. Understand? Okay. Can we need I to help? talk to. What if there's another locked door? I think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen and Omid need anything, okay? Okay. So we gotta check the whole house, right? Well, oh, not the... Empty. Nothing. Water's off. No electricity. No power. Great. My dog Walter. <sighs> I'm sorry about your dog, kid. Nothing. All cleaned out. Really, you couldn't go the other way? I'm not that hungry. Besides, I need to finish checking the downstairs. Must have stopped working a while ago. Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. How's it coming? I mean, I need to talk to Clem about the radio. I mean, I feel betrayed. What the hell? Not exactly my style. Hey guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far so good. How's that couch treating you, Omid? Leg feeling better yet? 
I'm all right. I feel you. What do you guys think about this plan at Kinney's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kenny's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope she has right. a point. For all our sakes. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. All right, Clem. Your turn. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. Ask her about the damn radio, man. What are you waiting for? No, he said they're checking. Why do I need to check that door? That's a closet. All clear in here. The bathroom here. So, okay, yeah, I was about to ask, like, well, wait, so where's the front door? Can I get that? No, I cannot. Jesus. No. Oh my god. What? It's a mob, dude. What happened? It's nothing. Just uh, nothing. Damn you, mob. I should break you in half. Well, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Uh, uh just nope. dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. Yes, she is. Don't sugarcoat it. He's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. He's Clementine. a freaking pedophile. Honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Oh, no. Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? Oh, what it's happened? Kenny. What? Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. What the hell? Stay here. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my God. Suspense is killing me. Kenny? What are you doing? Kenny, you okay, man? He broke. Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. What? Oh, 
he's a uh, dummy. It's just he's a not a. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here, starved to death. Oh Jesus my gosh. I don't know if I can do it, Lee. Not, not again. I can't ask you to go through this again. Let me take care of it. Are you sure? I guess we'll find out. Oh man. Give gun to Kenny. No, what would I give? This must have been where he slept. Just ran out of food, like we almost did. Like we still might. Poor kid must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. Oh, this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found him. That is so true. Oh man, I'm sorry, kid. Oh no. I'm sorry. Oh no. We should bury him. I'll take care of it. Wow, that <sighs> just imagine if that's if that were to happen one day in real life and humanity just comes down like it breaks down just like how it's happening in this video game and all the hard choices you gotta make. Jesus Christ. Well guys, I'm gonna stop it right here. If you guys enjoy that, please give it a thumbs up. You know, hit that like button. Oh man. Um, if you're new, please subscribe. It will really mean a lot to me. I really p appreciate it because it means that you enjoy my videos. And I guess other than that, I'll see you guys on next gameplay. Take care. Stay beautiful. Peace.